Hello, hello. Good day, everyone. Uh, today, I'm back. This is Janet. And my purpose of today is to redo the uh, orchids pot so that it will have again a beautiful flowers because I have noticed that some of the orchids leaves are getting yellow or it's not healthy anymore so what I'm going to do I will examine what's the problem inside there and I will remove also the old rotten roots and also I have here like the bark of the trees and some charcoal to add more or to improve the condition of this orchid so that it will bloom again beautifully so far we have one more pot as you can see here that it's still blooming and flowering actually this was already like four weeks ago but you know orchids the flowers stay longer some it will take even more than two months to nearly three months and but i'm still wondering why though it's flowering but the leaves are looking yellow so i'm going to replace i uh, remove this and see what's going on inside the pot okay so what i need in here is a pair of scissors and also just a spray of water so now i'm going to check this plant because six months ago it has a beautiful flower but of course it died off and i want to know why the leaves are not healthy okay oh as you can see two three days ago i put this indoor plants of ours outside for a little rain but what i've noticed it gathered a lot of water in here inside the pot and of course i'm going to throw this and change the water now regarding this plastic as you can see oh there's even a rotten one this is really not good I have to remove that and I have to check the inside part of this but just be careful on removing this press it well so that you will not spoil the roots some roots are healthy but some are really dried so that means it has no more life and that I am going to remove it Ooh. Wow. Okay, it has a good combination of bark and charcoal inside. But as you can see, see these are the old ones. This needs removing. I have to redo everything. I'm sorry, the other day I added a little bit of soil. That's why the water maybe turns brown. And you know the weather today is so nice and cool so this is a good chance of changing what's going on here inside okay i'll remove all these old roots it has no service anymore okay well as you can see i removed that but it has still roots there Set that aside, throw it into the bin. See this? It's an old root, so that needs to go into the bin. And also, it has a beautiful flower here six months ago. This needs removing. Just be careful when you remove so that it will not break good ones. Oh, it's really hard even. So, the feeling of these orchids now is just like you are going to the saloon, going for your haircut, or just going for your 
manicure and pedicure and then you feel better and relaxed mm -hmm. that I removed that other old room as you can see this needs also removing wow a lot of work to do with these small orchids how about the rest of my other pots such a lot to do and hopefully in a few months time it will bloom again mm. good thing there's no smell in this rotten roots otherwise if you get the smell it's there's fungus in it and just be careful when cutting and discarding it so that it will not contaminate the rest of your other orchids other pots still more yeah that needs to go as you can see when i will pull this root oh this is still strong huh there is still a bit of roots over there you know why the purpose of this outer layer skin is for the protection of course of the inner root and it absorbs water or the air for the orchids to grow better see this even i did not remove before because i didn't know that these are the old stem for the flowers that also needs to go and this also needs to go wow. so i will update everyone after a few months of house my orchids after redoing the pots and the roots removing and cleaning these old ones the dyed roots such a lot Oh, though it's still green but it doesn't look nice mm -hmm. that's a lot there inside okay guys I'll show you after a while oh. 